Hello everybody and welcome back to Young Sam 10. Today I'm going to build a bridge out of 19 straws and one pencil. Sorry Mr. Stricker, I can't find another straw. We just grabbed a handful from McDonald's and didn't get too many weird looks. But I'm going to be building uh, a bridge out of these straws, this tape, this cardboard. Thanks Bisquick for sponsoring this video, but not really. Yep, yeah, let's get started. All right, there are my 19 straws. So, I don't think this has to be that wide. That's what the cardboard is for. This cardboard will make it a little wide. Let's actually cut that out. So, is this angled right? So this is like, oh, that's a little less than a foot long, actually. That's not good. Um, that's fine because when the straws are underneath it, kind of like halfway, like this, that'll make it a foot. So let's start taping the straws on. So what this will kind of work, I could also do this kind of thing, but that's really weak as you can see. I might need to elevate it a little bit more. Maybe I can put the bridge this way and then we you kind of got like a path. That could work. Maybe I'll just edit the picture in now. Alright, so this looks pretty good so far. Now I've kind of got to make the truss supports. How am I going to do that? If I could put, maybe I can fold these in half. Kind of like that. Or would that just make it really weak? No, I kind of like that better. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, that'll work. <laughs> it's just really ugly. Oh! Oh, no, that's a ruined piece of tape now. God. Maybe this will work. Maybe I'll actually have a successful project. This is looking pretty strong, though. I might need to reinforce some of this with straws. Um, or maybe just add some more or something. Oh, crap. This came untaped. Hold on. Oh, wow, this, it's ugly, but, you know, it works. It keeps us standing up, if you know what I'm talking about. But, I gotta have to make another one. Then, like, 
put a straw in the middle. I'm gonna have to like cut a straw down to size. Let's make it, what? How long does it need to be? Probably like that long. And of course that piece goes flying over here. All right, um, this will probably be good for now. If I kind of put it like in here, find a way to monster truck that on there with super glue or duct tape or something. Uh, for now, let's start um, kind of reinforcing this area, I think is what we should do. Sometimes my genius it generates gravity. Oh, I've still got another straw. Um, what do I use this for? Flag? Oh, look at that. It's kind of angled, but it's fine. It's fine. This will be a good thumbnail. <laughs> We don't care about how it looks here at the Young Sam 10. We care how it performs. It's kind of like Bugatti. Because their cars are super ugly, I think. But they've got good performance. Funny how I'm comparing my 20 subscriber YouTube channel to freaking Bugatti. Wow, it's so ugly, man, but it works, which is good. All right, let's start um, building the other triangle thing. <gasps> Look at that. I'm gonna need more tape, but that's good for now. Um now this this contraption piece that's obviously not long enough. Um I could use this. I'm gonna cut it uh that much. And let's let's make two of them. Um, 
No, no, don't, please, please don't break, just, but I think that's good. I think now we're ready to do the test. I'm going to elevate this a little bit because this obviously is not going to work. Perfect. Let's start loading it up. We are going to do the weight test now. So I've got this 2007 Subaru Impreza WRX STI. It's a lot of words, but anyway, it's really cool. I like how they put the dirt on it. So this is probably 20 pennies. No problems at all. Let's do the Canadian van. I actually really like this. Don't mind all the dust on the wheels. It's from me drifting it around on a dusty area. Don't ask. Um, that's another 30 pennies. And let's get the Lotus. I think it's a Lotus 11. 2012 Lotus Exige. No, S. All right. It's 132 scale. I don't know if anybody cares about that, but how am I going to get this? So I put that in there. That's what? 40 pennies plus that is 30. <laughs> that looks kind of weird. It's okay. That's um, 20 plus 20 plus 30. That would be... 40 plus that's 70 pennies right there so i need one more 30 ish penny object um what is there hold on let me find something found it this is another about 30 pennies put that on top of the wrx look at that we got ourselves a pretty sturdy bridge here dang all right, that's 100 pennies. Let's see how much more I can get on. Let's use a dead GoPro battery, which is what? 10 pennies, maybe? Probably less than that. Oh, oh. I can fit a few more things. I got this. A marble. A literal one tiny marble. That's one penny. All right, that's no problem. Uh, let's actually use some coins. Um, quarter. Penny. Where can I fit all these things? I'm just literally cramming as much stuff as I can on here because I do not have 100 pennies. As you can see, it's like exactly one foot long to that tape measure. Um, let's put the jar on. The jar is going to uh, crush it. I want that to be a finale. Let's um, put this little metal on. <laughs> Top the van. Eww. So you saw it's one foot, so I think I'm okay to use a tape measure. Oh my gosh, how much can this hold? And I'll show you underneath if this GoPro can see it. Yeah, I'll just take it off my head. There's space under there. I'm on. So that's probably the limit of this <laughs> bridge that I've created. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. I hope this is a good assignment. I'll see you guys next time. Peace. When I fuck off, then you go get me just a little bit I drop, baby, too, from the money, from the bread